Good morning and welcome to today's verse. Today's verse comes to us from 2 Peter chapter 3, verse 1, and I will read it. It says, as his divine power has given to us all things pertaining to life and godliness through the knowledge of him who called us by his glory and virtue. Here we should be encouraged to know that we like nothing because God has provided for everything that we need in life. And not just, I mean, the physical life that we have, but life eternal that he is the very source of life. We have life uh, by virtue of being born into this world, born of woman, of uh, physical birth, but that is not life in and of itself. True life and the fullness of life is life that we have in Christ Jesus our Lord. He came that we may have life and that we may have it more abundantly, an abundant life with the hope and the joy of knowing that one day that we will be in the very presence of the Lord. He has given us all things. Notice it is through his divine power and it is through the knowledge of him. See, we have the word of God as this inexhaustible repository of information to help us to live a, a holy and obedient life. And we can only do that by opening the word up. See, we can't leave it over here in a corner and then it becomes part of the furniture and uh, something that we just look at, but rather God has made it such that through the knowledge and understanding of the word of God that we can live an obedient, disciplined, holy, righteous life with the help of the Holy Spirit reminding us exactly what is in the word of God, teaching us, guiding us, and directing us along the way. God has given us all things, all that we need. We lack nothing because God has supplied everything that we need that we might live in such a manner as this. As his divine power has given us all things that pertain to life and godliness through the knowledge of him who has called us by his glory and his virtue, by his moral excellence. <laughs> to God be the glory for the great things he has done. I pray that you would meditate upon this verse and it would be a word of encouragement to you as you go throughout your day. Be safe out there and then tune in again tomorrow. Yes, as we consider today's verse. Amen.